It's spring in Plymouth, the happy, healthy ocean city by the sea. Mel Norton's Trick of the Week. It's the 30th of January 2016 and, and we're getting ready for Valentine's already. That's not cool. Then it has the jack rock. Let's uh, catch it with Martin Norton now. Two days earlier than usual, but uh, he can't fit it in this week for some reason, so uh, let's catch up. And there's that rainbow flag again. Hello Martin, how are you today? Two days early. Oh, David Nixon, I remember him. He's the bald-headed guy that used to be on television. The bald-headed guy. The father of TV magic. He was, he was fantastic. I used to watch him every Saturday. So how are you today? So, because of him, many of us are where we are today. Yes, he's the one to blame for me, sat around here, cold, on a Saturday. Well, I've just taken my fleece off, my jumper off, I mean, my jacket off. And... <sighs> Goodness gracious me. I've just seen a guy in the street. Um, he's apparently a schizophrenic, but he's smoking a cigarette. I think he had a split personality. <laughs> Oh, well, I've heard worse. They're all a bit quick today because um, <laughs> caught off guard, so to speak. Uh, oh, yes, yes, uh, we weren't quite uh, planning on this, were we? However, uh, I, I just thought I'd show you what my daughter did in... Uh, no Ben or Fiona today. Um, her hours of not a lot to do. And she sat down and she made me this lovely pack of playing cards. See, she's uh, drawn back some on the back. Can you buy those? Uh, no. You From your magic them. shop in the Barbican? Shh. The story goes that my daughter made them, not that you can buy them. Oh, well, I mean, but you... Sure, I don't know <laughs> your daughter might have made them, as far as I know. Um, yeah, you see them. I didn't see the Queen of Clubs. Which you might be uh, making them specially, so you, uh, you can sell them. Ace of Clubs, Two of Clubs... Uh, what's that? Queen... Oh, it must be the Queen of Diamonds. Diamonds are forever. No, it's January, you're sick and tired, you've been hanging on me. Clubs. You make me sad with your eyes, you're telling me lies. They're nice little patterns. It's um, contemporary modern art, I think. Yeah, all the... <laughs> Three of spades. Oh, three of yeah, spades. Yeah, she's got this strange sense of humour as well. Anyway... Well, you can I, never I, get spades free when you go to the shop. Yeah. Oh, uh, 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 not like your candles, you can get four candles. <laughs> See, she's come up with this... Um, Script copyright. This, bar, um, <laughs> this lovely, wonderful deck of cards which you can't really do much with. And I thought, well, it'd be sort of nice if I could turn up to a gig with this deck of cards and just go and end up uh, being able to do a card trick with um, what might look like a normal deck of it's cards. It's an animation, isn't it? No, no, just a, 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 a deck of cards. You're thinking of a different trick. Of course, what I could do is uh, just, just say stop when you get the urge. Stop when you get the urge. Right. You look at that card, Ooh, remember uh, what it is. I can see it. Through um, the camera, yes, I think it's... Um, a spade, uh, possibly nine of spades. Yes. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> well, let's a, a let's, let's try that again. Uh, okay, say so stop. Oh, yeah. Say stop. Stop when you get the urge. There. You happy with that? That's uh, it. Uh, That'll do. So, um, now send me your thoughts. Send me your psychic thoughts. Yes, I do work out. Thank you very much. Nice to be the. You uh, can work out. It's a yeah. spade. Uh, is it the eight of spades? It could well be. Yeah. Thank you uh, very much. Well, uh, of course, this is uh, all, all yeah. very well, Lots but then what I'd really like is to keep my daughter's deck the way that it was before we started all this. Has she got a boat then? Hmm? Has she got a boat? Mm, yeah, I think she has in the bar. Because boats have decks. Oh. Um, Right, let's see how your psychic ability is today, ladies and gentlemen, for you. Have you got any jokes, Mark? Have I got any jokes? Apart from um, no, for me to look at. <laughs> <coughs> no. That's why I'm this side of the camera. And the beautiful people the other side. Oh, oh I'm glad you recognise that. 
Here in my wallet, I have a prediction in this little envelope, which we and will, a lot of cobwebs, which we will come as back usual. to um, in a minute. Here I have a deck it of only takes a minute, man. playing cards. Well, that's quick. Uh, now what I'm Turn going to do? Uh, just say stop where you get the urge, and wherever we stop, that's where we'll start the trick from. Stop. Okay. Where do you get the edge? I am going to deal the cards onto the table like thusly. Deal no deal. And when you get the urge, I want you to stop me. Oh, stop. Uh, <laughs> just there. There? Yeah, well, don't move at all. Uh -huh. I want you to stop there. Uh, oh, right, okay. So you You've would... actually moved. You cheated. So you could have absolutely no idea whatsoever what the next card is. Uh, I wouldn't know what the next card is because I was looking at the one before. Uh -huh. So I've messed it up, have I? <laughs> no, 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 but you have no idea what that card I is. I haven't, no. No idea where you have stopped it. So if I take this envelope out of the, uh, well, the camera, wallet here... The people on the camera would know because they would have seen it. Um, would they? But I wasn't concentrating. Well... Can I zoom in? <laughs> oh yeah, you can, oh, you can even peek in the envelope. Thank you. <laughs> in the envelope is one playing card. One playing card alone, nothing oh. else. In the envelope is the three of hearts. The card you stopped at, ladies and gentlemen, was of course the three of hearts. Was it really? And if you'd gone one further, you see, it would have been... One step further, and I should have been there. Yeah, Another you. song. We'll forget that Chris screwed up the last time. <coughs> and we're about to present this wonderful trick with this deck of cards. And, uh, oh, I must show you the prediction here in my wallet, which we will come back to in a mo. Meanwhile, I will take this deck of cards. Um, me just like Claire, say, say, stop when you get the urge. Stop when you get the urge. Right there, you're happy. Happy, I'm very right. happy. Okay. Start dealing from this point onwards, and when you get the urge, Ooh, say I've stop. Got the urge, stop. Okay, you're happy there. Yeah, absolutely happy. And I yeah. clap my hands. Now I know last time you wanted to stop on this card, so far be it from me to uh, destroy your what's in the jig. Here is my prediction. If you remember. Yep. And here in the envelope, yes, I know you want to peek in the envelope before I take the card out. My word! And there, in the envelope, is the predicted card you would stop on. That's a, such a clever trick, Malcolm. Thank you very much. I turn myself around now All I ever wanted 
Thanks to Mal Norton and Fiona from Pinnacle Arts. You can find them all on Facebook. The house that Jack built, Mal Norton and Pinnacle Arts. This has been a Chris Summerfield Media Production 2016. You can contact me, sponsor me and support me through PayPal at ChristopherSummerfield at gmail.com. Thanks for watching this video. It's about life. It's about art. It's about being creative.